Hey guys, this is HD coming at you guys with another audio commentary and today we're going to actually be looking at Kulos Ravine and the players are going to be Sen the Korean so this is going to be a continuation of the Sen replay, ba uh, replay pack he's going to be playing Zerg here at the bottom right hand corner of the map and his opponent is none other than NC Yellow whether or not this is the real NC Yellow remains to be seen but uh, it, is gonna, it is on the Korean server so I mean the chances are you know pretty high that it is the real one or I could be completely wrong, but it is going to be on Kulas Ravine, Zerg versus Terran again. And so I'm excited to see what both players have up their sleeve. Uh, one thing about this map is it is kind of difficult to grab your natural expansion. Um, if you were, say, like a Protoss player, it would be really, really difficult. But the Zerg is probably the most prone to getting an expansion, so I don't think that's going to be a difficulty here. Even though there's like two huge choke points to get attacked, as well as, you know, there's this ridge as well, so... Uh, you know, Thor ships, siege tanks, a lot of things can happen. But I don't think Sen is going to deviate. I think he's still going to get that expansion just because if you don't, you're really far behind. Either that or Sen might try to sneak a gold or something like that or, or expand somewhere else on the map. That's definitely a possibility too, so we'll keep our eyes on, on that. Looks like he's going to get his drone into NC Yellow's base right away. NC Yellow going to cross up with the drone so he knows that uh, the Zerg player is going to spawn somewhere down here. Spawning pool going up at 14, so we'll see if he throws up a 15 hatch. Meanwhile, back at NC Yellow's base, he is getting a Rax and a pretty fast refinery too, so he's probably going to be going Reapers here. And I've got to say, Reapers are very effective on this map. It's a straight gut shot all the way down to uh, the, the right side of the map, all the way down to the Zerg player's base. So it's really, really threatening. And uh, I wonder why Sen didn't place his spawning pool like right here to block off a Reaper from coming around the mineral line. That's definitely something you can do if you're a Zerg player. And look at this, he's not going to be getting a fast expansion. He's actually going to be getting an Extractor. And I've got to say, the reason for that is because he saw this fast gas, he saw this Rax, so he might be assuming a, a possible Reapers, but it doesn't look like a Tech Lab has gone down yet, and he's just pumping out Marines. So perhaps the Speedling or the, uh, the one extractor build without getting ha uh, expansion is to prevent a possible Reaper bunker rush at this location. So let's see here. Looks like NC Yellow is going to be getting a pretty fast factory as well. So it's a little strange that he didn't decide to get the Reapers because he was definitely in a position to do that. I think it's strong on this map. Sen is going to be sending out some lings here. He's probably expecting Reapers somewhere on the map, but he's going to get in here and see that there is a factory going up. And when he sees that, he might just throw down his natural expansion somewhere around the minimap. Good, a little bit of good scouting here so he now knows that there is a factory going up and that means that there will probably be some Hellions yeah we do have a first Hellion on the way second racks being added on so we're probably gonna see a Hellion into a marine uh, marauder infantry tech switch Zen knows exactly what's going on though it's interesting that he hasn't thrown down an expansion yet he's actually getting a roach warren right away keep in mind that this replay is post patch 11 or pre patch 11 excuse me and he's actually getting several roaches uh he might be trying to do some kind of a roach rush here and nc yellow sees this roach worn he saw it going up with that scan so this is pretty bad he needs to get some kind of units to deal with the roaches and he doesn't have any correct counter units he's just got pure marines and he's still pumping out hellions and unfortunately those are not what you need against roaches he is getting a tech lab though so he's probably going to get straight up Marauders right now. He needs to throw another Tech Lab down. The Roaches are on the way though. Uh-oh. NC Yellow could be in a lot of trouble. This is a pretty menacing force for pure Marine Hellion. Which, by the way, don't do any damage to the Roaches. And here we go. NC Yellow is going to be forced to pull back. This is the one drawback of not walling off your choke. And he's just going to run straight in, snap off a couple of the Marines. And when the Marauders come out, NC Yellow is going to have a much better chance. He does have one hiding behind the wall right now. Uh, when with proper micro, he might be able to hold on. He needs to pull some SCVs too, I think. These roaches are really, really threatening. They can go straight for the gas, stop the gas from mining right now. Um, they can do several things. Ling's coming in as well. The Hellion should be able to deal with that. 
And he just needs to keep pumping Marauders right now. Maybe even research the Concussive Grenades. Uh-oh, this Hellion... Oh, the Marauder goes down. That is huge right there. Now he's only down to one Marauder. Dealing with all these Roaches, that is really, really bad. And, oh, man. Uh, Sen is still pumping in more units. He's still pumping in tons of Mara uh, bleh, Lings and Roaches. This is really, really bad for NC Yellow because Sen isn't looking to expand or anything like that. He's not trying to harass. He's trying to end the game right now. And he's got the forces to do it. There are three Marauders. Are the SCBs going to pull off the line to help? They really need to peel right now to help these Marauders. And here we go. This is going to determine who's going to come out ahead in this game. Lots of SCBs going down. Taking a look at the units lost to have both players about even. Uh, most of the Roaches getting taken out there. But I think several SCBs have gone down. And now the Lings are up in the mix as well. Tons of more Speedlings flooding in. And so many SCVs have gone down. I don't think NC Yellow came out ahead. And I think this attack has been effective. I think that uh, Sen is going to come out ahead in this game. He's just got too many lings in the mineral line now. And that is going to be a fast GG for the uh, former Korean pro versus Sen. So good game there. And hope you, hopefully you guys enjoyed that. So that was a fast, nice Roach Speedling Rush.